Hey guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. Um, just wanted to um, just chit chat with you guys for a little bit. Um, uh, tell y'all a little bit about my week this week. Uh, I had a pretty good week. Um, uh, of course, it was Valentine's Day. Um, my daughter, she uh, she went to their Valentine's dance, and uh, then my twins, girl and boy, they uh, they didn't want to go to their Valentine's Day dance. Um, cause, uh, my oldest daughter, she went on her first date. Well, she went to the movies with a friend, um, and it was a boy and I'm okay with that. Um, you know, I am, they went as friends and they just, they went to go see the Sonic movie and, you know, I'm excited for for that period of her life that she's in right now um it's you know some parents w may not agree but i'm a pretty open parent and you know i try to make my kids happy i'm i'm a good mom and i try to um you know do what's best for them but uh she really wanted to go see this movie and uh this boy offered to pay her way and that's fine i'm i'm okay with that um you know, I feel like that our our kids today, um, they they go through so much that we don't, you know, quite understand or maybe we don't know as parents, you know, what they go through. Um but I think, you know, sometimes our uh, our society that we live in today, sometimes they they want to label our teenagers as being bad or making poor choices for themselves. But, you know, each parent is different. Each child is different. Um, you have to, as a parent, you have to feel good about the decisions that you make as a parent um, and not worry about what other people make. I know that, um, you know, we we don't know what our kids go through. Uh, I try to be the best parent that I possibly can be. And, you know, I, I probably let my kids, you know, do uh, probably a lot of things that some parents won't let their kids do. But I'm a fair parent. You know, they have to earn, um, they have to earn time and what they they have to earn um, their what they want to do or what they would like their freedom to be. They have to earn that. Um, and earning that means um, they know what I expect from as a mom. You know, they, of course, you know, you, you get the, oh, I just don't want to do that or, or why, you know, I do get that from time to time, but you know, you, you have to raise your kids the best way that you can possibly do. You know, each family's different. Um, I, I talk to my children. I, um, get on their level. No, I don't know what they go through. They are, um, we, today we live in a, a day and age in our society, um, to where we, we don't, you know, we don't know what our kids go through. We didn't, they go through things that we, you know, as parents did not go through when we were their age. We can't possibly know what, they they go through on a day-to-day -day basis and I understand that um I do uh talk to my kids I do get their opinion they are individuals and they have their own opinion and they are titled to that um you know I probably do get looked down upon from some parents and I'm sure that I'll get ridiculed for you know things that I'll let my kids do or you know or not let them do. Yes, I'm a very strict parent, but I'm a very fair parent too. Um, but I just wanted to, you know, let you all know that part. But back to my daughter going on her date. Um, I'm not ready for that. But, you know, yes, some parents will or some people, well, she's too young to do that. She's too young. 
but she's very mature and she knows what I expect from her. Do I trust boys? No, I don't trust boys, but, but I do trust my child. I trust my daughter um, to make the right choice. I only hope and pray that I have brought her up to make those good choices for herself. Um, you know, she, she had a wonderful time and I'm so, so glad she did. Um, but she, she said that, uh, she's not ready to be in a relationship and I understand I'm not ready for her to either, if you will. Um, but she, um, sorry guys, I, I know I look a mess, but, um, it's just Sunday afternoon and not doing much of anything. Um, but you know, I want, I want, you know, to be that parent that understands their kids. And, you know, I do talk to my children about what is best for them and what their opinions are and how, if they've made a poor choice, then, you know, I, I do ask them what, what is the better choice that you could have made? Um, you know, I may not like what they say, but I, I have to respect what they say. Um, I love my kids very much, and I want the best for my children. Um, I try my hardest to be the best parent that I possibly can be. And no parent's perfect, no kids are perfect. By all means, I know that. Um, but, you know, I do have a special bond with my children. You know, I take what they say or their um, feelings in consideration. Uh, a lot of parents don't. A lot of parents want to assume things or uh, think that they know best what's for their children. Um, you know, it's hard. It, it is very hard being a parent. And I know this. Um, but you as a parent know your child better than anyone else. If you have, um, if you think, or if you, you have to go with your gut about your kids. If you think that, you know, something's wrong in, down in your gut, you know, uh, then, you know, by all means, go with what your gut is. Uh, me letting my daughter go out, um, Saturday, I went with my gut. I mean, I know this boy. I know he's a very respectful boy. He's a type of boy that says, yes, ma'am, no, ma'am. Um, you know, I asked her when she came home, uh, did he try to touch you inappropriately? Did he, you know, did he ask you out? Did he buy you, thing, buy you something? She said, no, he didn't ask me out. You know, he didn't touch me, you know, uh, touching. I mean, did he hold her hand or, you know, something like that? No, he didn't. He was very respectful of her. And, you know, that's the type of girl that I am looking for to date my daughters. Um, but as I said, she, is, she said she's not ready for that. It kind of made her feel a little... Um, a little uncomfortable, if you will. Um, she didn't know how to act or, you know, really know, you know, and I'm glad for that. I'm, I am, I'm glad as a parent that she's not ready for that. But, uh, um, I want my children to make good choices in their life. You know, they, their path, either they can choose the path of on the left or the path on the right. Um, I feel like that my kids are old enough on some levels to make decisions for themselves. Um, yes, I try my best to be a good mom and to be a good, good role model for them. Um, no, my choices as a parent is not always right. Um, but I, I know how I grew up and I know how I want them to grow up. I want them to, you know, be better as, better than I was. Um, I, I grew up in a very hard, hard life and, a re, and 
you know, I wasn't close with my parents. As I told you all in my couple videos before that, um, my dad, he was, he was a bad alcoholic and he was very abusive. And I don't want my kids around that. Um, yes, I have a glass of wine maybe once a month or I might have a few wine coolers or something. But as far as getting drunk, no. I don't want my kids to see that. I don't want them to grow up in that. Um, as a um, child coming from a parent that was an alcoholic and a, a, an abuser, I don't want that. I don't want my kids to be around that or see that. Now, when they grow up and they have their own lives and they, you know, if that's the choice that they make, as a parent, you cannot beat yourself up for things that, you know, that, you've the choices that you've made or something or maybe it wasn't the right choice for your child but you can't beat yourself up you can't go through life you know oh I hope I did the right thing you know you can't do that um but I I do know that if you say something to your kids and I know I'm just rambling on but you know it's it's things that we as um as parents do need to heal here but you know I, I will tell you this if you if you say something and you didn't mean for it to come out that way sometimes it will do more harm than good um, if you you know say something awful to your kids well they remember that they don't forget that you know, it's it's going to scar them. It's going to damage them for the rest of, rest of their life, probably. They will probably have, um, you know, they will just probably have emotional things wrong the older they get. Um, but, you know, you just have to trust yourself as a parent that you have made good choices and the right choices for your for your child. Only you know your kids. Um, you know, you just have to do what you think is right as a parent. And, um, you know, that's about all that you can do. Just listen to your kids. Listen to what they say. Um, you may not agree with the decisions or what they, they are talking about. Or maybe you don't like the things that they ask you or, you know, may tell you. Um, you might not be happy with that, but... Just think before you say things because sometimes we as parents say things that we don't mean, you know, I mean, what, what are you going to do? But, you know, I, I do have a, um, very good relationship with my children and, uh, my kids are, are pretty happy kids and, you know, I always know as their mom, um, something, if some, if they're unhappy about something, I know it. And I always want them to feel open and comfortable to come and talk to me. I would much rather them come and talk to me than go in and talking to somebody else. Um, you know, sometimes I tell them that they can't do something and, you know, they, they do get upset with me, but then, then we talk it out as parent and and child does so um you know just just love your kids and just be there for your kids and try to try to understand maybe things that they're going through maybe you know just hear them out before you you make a decision and if you think that it's the wrong choice or a very poor choice then just ask them say you know what is a better choice that we can do um you know just just be there for your kids and love your kids and just acknowledge you know some things that are acknowledge things that they say take it take it into consideration and just hear them out um you know as i said we we just don't know what our kids go through but anyway i just wanted to get on here and chit chat for a few minutes and hope everybody has a wonderful week and i'll talk to you soon thank you thanks for watching my channel